Dichoso was a, a song that I got from, uh, from an artist called, uh, named uh, Willie Bobo, who's also passed, passed on many, many years ago. Uh, Willie Bobo was, um, was an East Coast kind of a guy, you know, New York kind of an artist in the beginning. And uh, he was, uh, he, he was a, a Latin percussionist, played timbales and, and, uh, and got a start over, over in, in New York and stuff and uh, around the New York area. And was very much a, a, a East Coast kind of guy and recording artist for many, many years. And then uh, eventually uh, he decided to come and live, he, he moved to the West Coast and uh, kind of following the steps of like Cal Jader and stuff like that, the West Coast jazzer guys, you know, and kind of Latin guys, you know. And uh, he became well known and was prominent artist of, of the West Coast now. He was a very, very LA kind of guy. And I, I, you know, Los Lobos. Way back when, we did like a couple of a couple of a uh, couple of gigs with him, you know. And uh, of course, I knew we knew who he was, and he was he was you know he got he got around the like the, the sort of like the East LA circuit, where he was playing like nightclubs and stuff in East LA that we used to go. I used to go hang out every once in a while to see him, you know, like with, with my girlfriend or whatever. And he he was he was just. Um, what a great artist, man! And, and 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 you knew most of most of his music. He was he was pretty pretty well known for as an instrument. Like an, all of his songs were instrumental, you know, instrumental uh, songs. And uh, he he wrote you know Evil Ways and all that, you know Carlos Santana Evil Ways, and uh, uh, a handful of other songs, but. Uh, he was such a such a such a great artist, and uh, uh, here again, uh, when I recorded that song, it's a song that I, I also had in the can. You know that I had actually that song doesn't go too far back though. It was last year that I started recording it. You know when the pandemic hit, I was just kind of just uh, you know staying home and stuff, and I was just kind of like getting in the studio and start messing around with stuff and. Uh, I started recording it for my own, my own bones, as I say, you know, and I just kind of uh, finished the song and stuff. And then uh, here again, I thought, well, you know, there's a place for for this song and this album, you know, being that he, you know, uh, Willie was such a such a part of the the Latino uh, sort of scene, you know, in L.A.